stay at home order. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> Me and, oh, <laughs> Me and Kriana heading to the store. That's many errands. Yes, <laughs> just the little store. I just need to get some stuff for my sauce that I'm making that I'm going to surprise you guys with. And Kriana just getting some last minute stuff. Of course, we need things like celery and stuff. You know, the stuff that you always forget and got to go get it on Christmas. So Merry Christmas, we in the spirit. We got on our red and green. <laughs> hey y'all, I've been gone for a minute, but I'm back now. So I just wanted to welcome y'all to Vlogmas 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Today is Christmas, Vlogmas day 25. What's up? What's up? So anyway, today for Black Friday, I am going to be introducing a Black business owner, a Black YouTuber, an inspiration named Be Love. She has a sauce on YouTube. Well, she has a sauce on Amazon, but you can watch her on YouTube while she's eating her sauce and talking and everything. So I watch her eat crab because I love crab. And when I'm eating crab, I'm eating with Be Love. <laughs> But that is my Black Friday inspiration. B loves Smackalicious sauce. So stay tuned while I prepare it and show y'all how it's done. Happy Vlogmas! Day 25. I woke up this morning to an orange sky. It is Christmas Day, and look at the sky. I guess when they said stay at home order, they wasn't playing. Stay at home, because the sky is red. Merry Christmas, everybody. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for hanging in there with me. So, when I open my room door, this is what I see. First thing I see, the first thing I see is the lights. Then I enter into the living room and I see a Christmas tree and all of our pretty decorations going on. So look at the presents that we have under the tree. We didn't do a big Christmas because we celebrate Kwanzaa too. So this will be our Christmas decoration on this side of the living room. Everything just decked out very festive and we love it and we have fun hey y'all i'm chilling here today getting ready for christmas dinner about to add the last add-on my last add-on is gonna be be loves life smackalicious sauce let me tell you be love inspired me i can't lie she kept me going through the COVID, through the quarantine or whatever because she um, was positive and she had her little sauce going and we was eating crab together and y'all know I love me some crab, right? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Dropping things. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going by the ingredients on here. And my, uh, I'm already messing up, y'all. The bag. Huh? The what? The bag. You said you was going to go by the ingredients on it's there. On the bag. Oh, just at the bag. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm going by the ingredients on here. As you can see, though, I'm already steaming it up. That's because this is thin pot. <laughs> so, yeah, I gotta give me some better pots. So, yeah, it says to start off with the four sticks of butter or whatever you want to use. It says unsalted sweet cream butter or butter substitution. And as we know, margarine is a butter substitution. Maybe I should turn the fire down soon. Just grind it up. Grind it up. So anyway, yeah. So beloved, like she was really positive. She inspired me to start YouTube because she was like, you know, what y'all waiting for? Y'all can do this. There's billions of people out there that starting channels and get views, you know. So next is a half medium sweet 
onion thing will be sliced. So, get my favorite knife over here. And as you can see in the pot, I got four sticks of butter. Melty, 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 melty. Okay, that's the one I'm gonna go Okay, so. I'm cut this onion up, y'all. This is my favorite knife. You guys shake. But yeah, I'm gonna cut this half onion up. I love me some onion. And yeah, I clean up, but um, I'm trying to go real fast. <laughs> so the video won't be too long for y'all. Y'all can see how my shrimp turned out. Slice it thinly. Because I know I'm gonna put the whole thing in, so slice it, slice it. Slice it, slice it. And the fire back up and I'm going in the order that she got them listed so I know my onions can be kind of chunky sometimes but I think it's a little more but you can always season it to how you desire like you don't have to I mean not season it but add I mean, if you like thick onions that's fine if not then you know they gonna turn translucent or whatever anyway so that's half an onion so next it says the third cup of minced garlic. Well, that's turn it up. Okay, so grab my cup. Let me see. Okay, so here's a third cup, and here's how minced garlic look. See how it's liquidy? I'm gonna shake mine up because yeah, this is minced garlic. Why I have minced garlic in my cabinet, I don't know what I'm using it for. <laughs> I never use minced garlic, but I somehow end up picking it up. Hmm. It's hard to open like it's brand new. Hmm. When does it expire? 4 6 2022. So what did it say? Three fourths cup of minced garlic? So I'm going to do three of these with the juice. Yes. Okay, one. So this is a fourth. Two. There's more juice than garlic coming out of this thing. So we have to fill this one up to the top. Okay, three. So we did get a little mixed minced garlic juice up in there too. Okay, so next on the agenda, we have three cups of pickled ginger. So I don't have pickled ginger, but I do have real ginger. And uh, I'm just going to clean up a little bit off it. Okay, so I got a secret the way I do my ginger because I'm hecka lazy, right? And I don't like sitting up here chopping down this little stuff. So I put the strain on here and I just do this. So this is real ginger. <laughs> A ginger root with the skin and everything. Oh, shoot. Okay. People chew on ginger roots. So, yeah. See? All you got to do is skin it, skin it, skin it. So, mine may not taste quite like hers. And I think ginger root is a little bit stronger than ginger. So, I think what I had was enough. She said you can season it to your own desire. So, <laughs> that's me and my lazy seasoning. <laughs> so, anyway, we got us some ginger in there. Y'all know ginger heck is strong, so. Okay, so now the ginger, now she said put in the sauce. Let's make sure the butter is melted first. Mm -hmm. Make sure all the seasonings. All the butter, the onion. Maybe I should wait till the onion cook a little more. But no, I'm gonna all to cook together. Cause she don't have like mix. I could have went to her, her uh, what you call it? Her YouTube page. I could have went to her YouTube page. She be loved on YouTube and she eat crab and do muffins. And I could have went to her page and did it. Cause she'll tell you like, okay, add this now, do this, do that. But the pack only have just the ingredients. It don't have instructions. So I'm gonna smack delicious sauce in. Look how it look. 
<laughs> Sorry, me. <laughs> Got a smack delicious sauce look. So I did a whole pack as one pack make one serving. So then I'm gonna mix that up. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Ooh. What you know about that? <laughs> That's what B Love be saying, y'all. I'll be watching her for real. I'm not ashamed to say I watch B Love eat crab on here. Okay. So, sorry, girl. Julia, <laughs> crown. <laughs> All right. So, we got this going, right? Now, it says to add a cup of water. It's in her chicken broth, but y'all didn't get no chicken broth. Now, I'm just gonna add water. But you know, the funny part, the funny part is the next ingredient. So, y'all just add my spring water. Okay. So, then next, hey, y'all! <laughs> okay, so I'm just trying to be fast because I don't want y'all to be like, hurry up, girl, what you cooking? So next thing is a four ounces of coke. So if for anybody that don't know, eight ounces equal a cup. So four ounces equal half a cup. So I'm gonna put half a cup of coke cola. I don't even hardly drink Coca Cola. Maybe sometimes. But I'm gonna put this. She said half a cup of coke. So I'm gonna pull that up in there and watch that bubble look like that there. <laughs> I like that. Let me just stir it for you a little bit. That's that beloved sauce, y'all. This is the mouth. She got hot too. So I can add something to it to make it hot. And I'll probably add cayenne pepper. But the last ingredient is a tablespoon of vinegar. I got white wine vinegar. Because I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I probably got some vinegar up there, but I don't feel like looking for it. So we're going to go with the white wine vinegar. Y'all think that tastes the same? Comment below. Comment below if that's the same or no. Okay. That's all the ingredients, y'all. This is how the sauce looks. So I guess I'm going to let it cook until the onions are transparent. And then I will come back and then y'all can see it with the shrimp. Because I still got to cook the shrimp too. <laughs> Hey, so far I'm doing better than Thanksgiving. <laughs> My cornbread came out good. I had pressure on Thanksgiving because I wasn't just cooking for me. Like, you know. But I just had to get my elements. Cornbread looking good. Mm -hmm. Getting ready. Getting ready. Okay. <laughs> me in the spirit. Turkey done. Turkey done. <laughs> Macaroni and cheese done. People be eating like five o'clock sometimes. No. All right, y'all. So it's time to do the shrimp. My sauce is getting thick. So my onions is good, but I want it to stay warm so it's on simmer. Now to do my shrimp. I like a little more butter. In my sauce, I like the buttery taste, but I don't want to ruin her sauce. I'm going to cook the shrimp in butter. So I got the raw peeled shrimp all clean, and deveined and everything. I'm just going to put them in the pot. Oops. I think. Mm -hmm. All right. So I'll put them in here. And then I'm just cook because they're not the cooked shrimp or they would already be pink. So these are the raw shrimp. But they raw but they don't take shrimp don't take long to cook. So I'm gonna cook these shrimps up. It's gonna take a minute because there's so many in the pot. Usually I just do about 10 but I'm cooking for everybody. Me, Fiona and David. They cook the mac and cheese and the yams and the turkey. I did the greens, the shrimp and the salmon. That's what we have for dinner. With B loves macalicious sauce. So I'm just gonna let that go on and heat up and then I'll stir it. And I will be right back. Oh wait, before I go, let me just show y'all. I just even though I got smacked, well, 
maybe I won't this time. I'm just going to sprinkle a little. Because you got to cook shrimp and season them to me. So I'm just going to just put a little. Usually I would be down in it with uh, seasonings so they can taste like they got sauce on it. But yeah, so do that. Just put a butter in. The rest of the seasoning will come from the sauce. Alright, y'all, see your turn of pink? Alright, I will be back in a moment to show you more. Okay, y'all, uh, so my shrimp is cooked to my liking, and all I have to do now is put them out with Smackalicious sauce, and I will show you then. Am I missing something up my foot? Okay. No, record you. I can't record, record you. Well, you got us too. Don't say nothing. Mm -hmm. My shrimp fell in the sauce. <laughs> okay, be love. I've been waiting for this all year long. I've been watching you eat this all year long. Here we go. The first bite. <laughs> David, you go try it. <laughs> okay, you gonna try a little bit, y'all. Is it good? <laughs> it's cool, it's different. <laughs> okay, so I watch Beloved eat it with everything, so I'm gonna dip a little turkey in mine. Get a little, get my fingers in there and get a little onion. Where the onion at? There we go. This the mild. I should. I didn't add no spice because I wanted to taste it in this pure form. Okay, got me a little onion on there. Get a little closer. my Christmas gift. Thank you, Lynn. Got me the wine. And over my wine, don't wine. I got a wine theme and Lynn, my friend, knew that and got me a calendar. That's for wine. I need calendars everywhere. And then, hey, Cree Cree. <laughs> then we got all my Christmas gifts. Shout out to Kriana. Look at my purse, y'all. Just super juiced. Got my bumblebee. I know I'm a beehive, a, a hornet, a <laughs> hornet, fresh uh, sac state, 
and I'm a beehive for life. And then I got the wallet that went with it. And then Keisha got me a wallet. Told y'all, look at that, loving it. And then I got this from my friend Al. I'm a trash Cheshire cat. I love, love my favorite Disney character. Y'all better remember this. I might come back for a Do You Really Know Me video and may be able to win a prize. So if you're one of my early people that's watching now, you know I love the Cheshire cat. He is I and I is he. <laughs> then I also got from Keisha some Stella Rose Moscato. And from Keisha, some chocolate, chocolate, <laughs> and some, she know me too. So my friends know me well. They know what I love. I love the Cheshire Cat. I love wine. I love wine items. And I love peppermint. So she got me some Twisted Peppermint Lotion and Chapstick. Go Keisha. And a payout, peppermint payout. Lotto ticket if I win, girl. Dinner on me. <laughs> and a Christmas bag with peppermints inside the good ones, too. The ones you chew up. Mm -hmm. And then my good friend Lynn got me the calendar. Also got me a protect key. I seen these on TV. I was like, I need one of those because I don't need to be touching stuff. And then I got me a electric toothbrush. Just love it, love it, love it. And my mom got me this canteen. Let me tell y'all about this canteen, y'all, with the two mugs. We went to Oceanside, and in the morning, I put my tea in there. Let me tell you, when I got home, the tea was still hot. Seriously, no lie. And the good part about it was I put the leaves in there with the water because I didn't have my teapot and strainer. When I pour it into the top, the tea, the, the leaves stuff don't even come out. And then last but not least, look at my spot set. Y'all know I be soothing on Sundays. So Kriana got me this beautiful robe with some lotion and some body oil and a massager. Y'all know. I'm Y'all know I'm going to do a video on the robe because y'all know I wash my hair on Sunday and maybe y'all all, all to the bed. So, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I just want to thank everybody. I love you so much. My mom, my daughter, my friends. Love y'all. Keisha, Lynn, Al, Kriana, Kamiya, Kamaya, David. <laughs> love y'all. Hey, so I hope y'all like the video. See my little Christmas, some of the outfit. Yep. Hope you like the video. If you liked it, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are new here. And also, leave a comment. Let me know if I did the sauce right, if you tried it before. If not, then you guys go over to her link. If you go to YouTube and just type in Be Loves Life, her channel will come up. And go check your girl out. She got like 2.2 million subscribers. Her sauce is selling like crazy. If you like seafood, this is some sauce that you can use with your seafood. Thank you guys so much for watching. Merry Christmas. A good note. Here's the Christmas tree in Jack London Square for those who've been abiding by the stay at home order and haven't at least just drove past. This is Jack London Square, Oakland, California. This is what it looks like. If you want to drive by, I'm sure to be up to almost New Year's. Merry Christmas. Thank you.